Just us. <laughs> just us. <laughs> hey, you can't even say just because Israel's so giant. It's like Israel's so numerous. Israel's not a small people. Israel's innumerable. You can't number Israel. They're like so great. Nations. Yeah, Israel, that's why each tribe of Israel is like a nation. A gigantic nation. You know what I mean? It says. Hey, they say, that's why the Lord spoke of that great multitude in uh, Revelation 7. Hey, we keep that. Get that Revelation. What you got? I'll, I'll pull it up. Go ahead. Yeah, it's a, too many precepts. But it's too high. Though. It really is. It's so much. We already know the two handles. Hey, you finished with that? I got some. Yeah, got a little bit more. It says, in the giving of the law and the service of God and the promises, whose are the fathers and of whom as concerning the flesh shall shine. Oh, God damn, I gotta read that again. What? Hold on, I gotta read that again. Whose are the fathers of whom as concerning the flesh Yahweh Shai came to the only came from Israel. Damn. That's bad. I, that blew Wait, my, you gotta read the whole chapter. Where's you going? Uh, yeah, Romans 9. This is my motherfucking mind. I have to stop. <laughs> start. Romans 9 is that fire chapter. Woo! It says, Who is over all? God bless uh, God bless forever. Amen. Keep going. We're gonna read okay. all of it. It says, not, not as though the word of God had taken an effect. So th th this word does take effect. People think, y'all out here, you're you wasting your time out here talking that bullshit. Okay. We are not wasting. The word of the Most High don't go out void. That's why we got brothers teaching on the streets in every major city in the United States. We got brothers teaching in London. All through the teaching of the word, we put this on the internet. We got brothers in London, Australia. brothers in Germany, brothers in Australia. Trinidad, Jamaica, uh, Jamaica Messi, uh, South, corners of the, Earth. the four corners of the earth, <laughs> Puerto Rico, North, South, East, and West. The Dominican That's why Republic. the destruction is happening right now. That's all kind of shit going on because it's being preached on the four corners of the earth. Oh, you got brothers in Africa. I was checking my analytics on YouTube. We got heavy, uh, we got brothers because you can look at how many minutes they watch and how many hours. Yeah, you can look at all that. Yeah. So we got brothers in Indonesia. I was just saying that's one of our top uh, 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 countries was Indonesia. So we got brother, and that's a mainly Muslim country, and they, and they watching our videos a lot down there. Saudi you know what Arabia. I mean? Uh, I see somebody, sorry, Raver, but I see somebody in uh, Israel watching one of my videos. Oh yeah, it's like one person though. But, hey, shit, but you, hey, that's hey, you got Israelites. Even though we say them Jews and fake like that devil to walk by, he, he's a devil. You gonna still have Israelites that look like one of them. But a lot of guys ain't gonna accept that. You know what I mean? You gotta have somebody that look like a rabbi. Look foul as can be or whatever, but his spirit would be different from the rest of them. But you know, it's all a mystery. The mysteries are not for everybody. That's why it's called a mystery. That's why it's called parables. Yep. Go ahead. It says, For they are not all Israel which are of Israel. They are not all, just, yeah, just because you're an Israelite, <laughs> that don't mean nothing. Because a lot of Israelites, they, they might be Israelites, but they might be retarded too. You know what I mean? Like we had this Israelite woman just come up against us and said she said all nations could be saved. That she's an Israelite, but she's not Israel. She called herself a heathen. We was like, okay, you're a heathen. Yeah. Go ahead. It's sick. That's what we was talking about before we came up here, man. Remember uh, the woman being permitted to speak in church? Yeah. Because they say stupid shit, man. They don't know what they say. Really? Stupid shit. Man. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> That's what we really shouldn't say about That's being too disrespectful. It's oh, the that's not being God. That's not God, buddy. That's not being God. Oh, Lord. That's uncivilized. Hey, you're a wise man, man. You don't go act like they got. How's that? You don't act like they got. Because they're out, man. You gotta be yeah. wise. Well, that's, that's a godly man that should have cussed around. Actually, the scripture. Actually, we come up short not cursing around. Actually, the scripture says they preach another man. gospel, uh, let them be encouraged. Could be permitted to speak. Yeah, yeah, but, they, but they uncivilized, you civilized. Why? Because the way we're speaking does not. It has nothing to do with us being civilized. I, I, I got it. The white man speaks perfectly. Look what he did to these people. Oh, look, look what he's continuing yeah. to do to us. But he speaks with eloquent words, pronounce all the syllables out properly. Like but look what he's doing. He's destroying the whole earth. He's destroying nations. Well, that's what we're doing. We do. We good at that. <laughs> we good at that. Hey, like the three pastors that just got caught in Columbus. Did you hear about three pastors? They Such turned the church into a prostitution ring. Right. 
But, but you don't see nobody breaking up against that. No, no, no. But I guarantee you, they, they never said a cuss word. You know, they was nice. Everybody respected them. Right. So how do you speak to a devil? You don't speak to a devil nice. You got to come out roughly so they can relate. That's how you relate to the people. You speak how they want to, you know, how they how they communicate. In a word they can understand. Right, exactly. So. They make savages. Well, yeah. Huh? They these call women, themselves savages. Well, the whole point of it is these it's women, like these women are savages. You know? That's they're the on a savage level. You got that out? Oh, yeah. yeah, they call themselves savages now. Like you said, soon they, the new word going to be stupid. Like, we stupid. <laughs> <laughs> this is First Timothy 2 and 11. Let the woman learn in silence with all subjection. But I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to observe authority over the woman, but to be in silence. To be in silence. So she came up here speaking for authority over the man. I think you read it wrong. You know? Read it so again. We returned to faith. Yeah, you just looked you know? We put her back, you know, we, we hit her with reality. No, I think you actually said woman instead okay, of man. You know what I mean? Because let me tell you something about these women. Oh, they don't respect us as men all the time. I be watching videos, I see. Watching. We always got here every Monday. We got here every Monday, man. At the same time. Same time. So you have a difficult time finding us. You know what I'm saying? All right, you an Israelite, man. This is only for us, man. Let me give you scriptures. Galatians 1 and 8. But though we or an angel from heaven preach any other gospel unto you, that which we have preached unto you, let him be a curse. That's you. And curse, that's where you get the word, the word cuss word comes from curse. That's the word cuss, you know, and curse means the same thing. I got another fire scripture for you. We corrected him. Now he's now he sees it. Okay. Now he's seen it. I got one. Uh, let me get this scripture real quick. James 2 and 9. If you have respect to persons, ye commit sin and are convinced of the law as transgressors. Yeah, you can. They going off, they going off, man. Man, she has sucked the soul out of you. <laughs> Sucky one. Make you a meal, too. Awesome. Give a fuck on say an old woman, man. So, oh, bitch. So, that bitch all her life been, 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 uh, been an enemy of your house and shit. Her whole life. And still an enemy of your house and shit. Oh, patience. Come on. What? Man, I'm in the chariot, man. I see a. Uh, 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 Fuck yeah, uh, him, uh, Elamite and an Edomite hiding in a closet. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's like that Noah movie. Where they had, uh, <laughs> oh, you're the castaway. Yeah, the castaway. <laughs> <laughs> I get this. Uh, Micah 5 and 8. And the raven of Jacob shall be among the Gentiles. Woo. In the midst of many people as a lion among the beasts of the forest. As a young lion among the flocks of sheep. Who is... He go through both trips down and tears a piece of and love can deliver. Ooh. Yeah, cause right now, right now we're the lambs and the sheep, right? But soon we're gonna be lions. I wish you had the nerve to say, that ain't no King James Version. <laughs> <laughs> King James. Right. I see him. I don't know. Just don't read Isaiah the left, man. No. Okay. And in that day, there shall be a root of Jesse which shall stand for an inside of the people. To it shall the Gentiles seek, and his rest shall be glorious. Uh, hold on a second. Yeah, because y'all know who Jesse is. Jesse was the father of King David. And the scripture said it's going to be a root of Jesse. And that started with King David. But then, then it's going into Yahweh Shai, the one y'all call Jesus. Because he descends from the, the uh, royal line of King David. Okay. Romans 1. Yep. He was really actually the... the He's the king of Israel. Yahweh is the king of kings, Lord of lords. That cuts off the virgin birth, too, right there. Oh, yep, it does. Before I go back to Isaiah, let me, let me read this real quick. Romans 1 and 3. Concerning his son, Yahweh Shai, our Lord, which was made of the seed of David according to the flesh. Hey, hey you're an Israelite, man. You can't just prove. Don't do that Egypt stuff, man. Oh, yeah. You gotta be cold as hell. <laughs> I'm free. I'm over here like hands in my pocket. He walking down the street like it ain't nothing. We trust more. Damn. <laughs> 
might be from a color of money. Damn. Or just got released out of jail too. Uh, oh, that's how they do it. Yeah. You've been locked up for a yeah, couple yeah, months. Fuck what it is out here. <laughs> I didn't let your ass out, bro. Yeah. Oh, nothing. You won't even yeah. let your just throw me out. Fuck yeah. I'd be happy to be out, though. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I got locked up in Fairfield County, man. All the way in Fairfield fucking County. When I got out, I did fucking three months. I went walking down the highway too much. <laughs> I literally was on the highway walking back to the county. I'm in a faggot ass workhouse. You get locked up there, they say, you and that they'll watch people and they'll yeah. arrest you again yeah. if you walk yeah. on the highway. Yeah. That's some yeah. faggot yeah. shit, That's man. That's some devil shit. Right. Back in verse 11. And it shall come to pass in that day that the Lord shall set his hand again the second time to recover the remnant of his people, which shall be left from Assyria and from Egypt and from Ephros and from Cush and from Ephraim. So what is that talking about? What does it mean recover his people? How is he going to recover his people? He going to do that through the teaching of the gospel. That's why, let me get a quick precept, just because this go hand in hand with the New Testament. Let me finish this. Oh, go ahead. From Shinar and from the Hetmo and from the islands of the sea. That means the Ooh, whole earth. I'll hold it you finish. I mean, what is that talking about? That is talking about what Paul was doing. He was going and recovering those lost sheep. That's what he was doing. Uh, Matthew uh, 28 and 18. And Yahawashai came and spake unto them, saying, All power is given. Yeah, yeah. He put it around us. Oh, that, 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 there's two of them. Yeah, he, that was a cop. Oh, uh, was he it? He avoided us, man. Oh, okay. He avoided us. He really did. <laughs> he took a long <laughs> way. Uh, that's the fear of the Lord over there. Yeah. Well, he already knows. Yeah, he, yeah, he they know about it. Yeah, I'm sure he does. I'm pretty sure the ones we talked to uh, went back and told them. Yeah, that's a powerful people. He looked like a head grab right? He's old. He's up. So he... He calls the people. That's why he asked if he could fake the Jews. That's why he took his hat off. Well, I can guarantee you he went over there to collect the shit. I'm like, damn. He ain't coming out with no paper dollars. He's coming out with gold and silver. You know what? Because they they, they, they they know there's certain things they can't do. Yeah, they they, they trying to get. They think they gonna get the promise back. That's all. That's all about. Because he saw they sold his birthright, and in his crazy ass, demented, fucked up head, he he's got. Yeah, he thinks it's hope. It's hope. It's hope. This is all right now. We going right now. All right, let me get this. Matthew 28, 18. Yahawashah came and spake unto them, saying. All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Oh, hold up. It was given to him. That proves that the one you call Jesus is not God. What well, the scripture says is the son of God because the power was given to him. He didn't give it to himself. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I commanded you, and lo, I am with you always to the end of the world. Amen. But that, that goes with that Isaiah. We say, go teach it to all nations. And that's how the Lord will you know, recover that the remnant of Israel that's scattered throughout the earth. The only way you can do that is by teaching the gospel. Why, why do you think Jeremiah said, I'm sending out fishers? Why do you think Yahawashai said, I'm going to make you fishers of men? Why are we going out and fishing? That's why you got to go to these other nations because our people are scattered. Let's go back to that. We being Gentiles, but it's like we become Gentiles. It's uh, Hosea 1. Hosea 1 uh, and 8. Hold on, I'm lost. No, 10. Then said God, call his name, Lo Amin, for ye are not my people, and I will not be your God. All right, this is talking about Israel because he yeah, he named one of the, one of his children uh, Lord, I mean, which means you're not my people. There you go. That's that's becoming Gentile. Yeah. Because yeah. they try to say uh, yeah. Uh, the Gentiles, they try. They really do. They just need to put down. 
That's Mercy Kid. All right, what's wrong with you? Definitely. He living in yeah, hell, definitely. man. That dude right there, I can only imagine the fuck that shit, you know what I'm saying? But he can't speak. That's true, too. Yep. Fucked up. That's for real. Nobody don't get no lower than that. That's as low as you can go. That's rock bottom right there. You don't hit it, but it. I see the check like that, man. Right? Uh, Especially. That's what I read earlier. It said uh, the wicked in this. That's the reason why we fucked up like that. Thank you, baby. Thank you, Your Honor. <laughs> thanks, thank you for all Thanks, Thanks for our comfy. Yeah, here you can. I give you that. Comfy is actually a thing. Right, right, right. Hello. That's why we still fucking here. Uh, the whole world of balls around here. Looks like it too. Shit, shit, she got her own fucking. past the whole earth. Uh, what's on family guy? If you take like a basketball and throw it at her, it will go into her orbit and start orbiting and start becoming a satellite. That's how fat. so fat. She got her own moon. Stinking ass. You know that ass stink too. Oh goodness. Oh, all that shit. Ah. You know that shit. Man. You know, you the baby get a bird from the shit man. not being wiped off. You know, get it for you. Yeah, you get all chapped up. Oh. Making a rash for the rash. Burning it burns, man. You know, don't wash your ass up a few days. Let's see. Hey, really bad leave it, dude. for the nation and shall assemble the outcast of Israel. The outcast. <laughs> oh, that's another thing too. Like, you know, the elders put out an order to do three videos a week. If you can't think of a topic, that's the topic right there. Just going to Israel and how Israel is scattered. That's an endless discussion. There's endless scriptures on it. Endless. It's endless. I mean, that's the whole, there's so many scriptures on it. It's, I, I don't I don't even know all the scriptures. Right, and the outcast, you all was disputing with niggas, man, that wouldn't accept the outcast that was coming from Greece and you know all the foreign lands, man. The outcast. Yeah. Fuck Jake, man. I get that Fuck uh Jake's non spiritual lands. I gotta buy a new pocket. I get that and uh gather together and gather together the dispersed. They all sound familiar this. similar. And he shall set up an insight for the nations and shall assemble the outcasts of Israel and gather together the dispersed of Judah from the four corners of the earth. Well, what is that talking about? That's what my Israel scattered among the whole nation. You know what people are saying? Oh, that, like that fake Judah walked by earlier? They'll say that was talking about them. They're not as numerous as the stars of heaven. They're very few in number. If you look up, uh, just Google how... What percentage of the world's population do the Jews make up? Because they're not the real Jews, but they make up like what, 0.01% of the world's population? So they're not as numerous as the stars of heaven. Yeah, I mean, most of them are homosexuals. They don't, they don't have, they don't like women. So how are they gonna be multiply and be as the sands of the sea? Have you seen your boy walk up? Hell yeah. <laughs> you seen how nasty yeah. he looked too, man. For real, man. <laughs> he looked disgusting. Yeah, yeah, he got a foul spirit. He was disgusting. He got a foul spirit. The spirit stinks too. Yeah. Yeah, because I remember that Jew on campus, man. He stank. He, his spirit stank. He had a stinky spirit. The stench man. came That's up. All. No, it smells no, noisome. Some motherfuckers literally don't wash, man. Nasty. They literally don't wash. And you know the black clothes they wear too? It's their custom is to wear them until they fall into pieces. Hey, until they vaporize. Yeah. 
all that money. They want to buy no more. And that's their holy that garments. Money. You know, the scripture said to wear uh, the the fringes, have fringes on your garments with a border of blue. They don't do that. They wear all black suits. They try to tuck it inside the shirt, have a little undershirt thing. Oh yeah, that's they going off. Here you go. This is um off the coast uh, the 13th tribe. Uh oh. 13, baby. Let me see that. Let me get that zoom close in. on the. Yeah, zoom in on that bad boy. Oh, oh there you go. You guys to get this book. Amazing book. Amazing yeah. book. You must be one of those anti Semites. Anti Semites. <laughs> anti Semites. Uh, uh, this is a. Uh, uh, hey, you was wearing this okay. satanic pentagram. Oh, uh, this is page 46. As for homosexuality, which in Arab countries was taken as a matter of course, Ibn Fatlan says that it is regarded by the church as a terrible sin, but in the only episode he related to prove his point, the seducer of the beardless youth gets away with a fine of 400 sheep. Accustomed to the splendid bass of Baghdad, our travelers could not get over the dirtiness of the Turks. The goods do not wash themselves after defecating or urinating. And the, and the Turks are Edomites. Like, uh, the Turks are Edomites. They, they the same, they're the same people as the Khazars and all that. The, Mongo, the Mongols are Edomites. The Turks are Edomites. And a lot of people don't know that. Genghis Khan was a, was a, a white man. They don't, people don't know that. That's why they had John Wayne play Genghis Khan in the movie. They didn't go get no uh, ch Chinese motherfucker or whatever. You know what I mean? They say these motherfuckers don't wash after taking a shit, man. Oh. So they had a, they had sores and everything on their butt, man. Sores and open lesions and everything, man. Cause you gotta wash. Nor do they bathe after seminal pollution or on other occasions. They refuse to have anything to do with water. Damn. Hey, you know that's that's funny, cause that's a spirit, cause water represents the truth. Nope. Oh, they refuse that's anything of the truth. They all wear the same clothes. Yeah, man, them most high, bro. So these Israelite women, man, them most high. There ain't no other women on the planet like an Israelite woman, man. I'll take it over there. Man, you motherfuckers lose their mind over that. Literally lose their minds. They kill each other over there. Because you ain't never going to see no, no, man, you know she out of shape and stuff, though. Israelite women be stacked. Like, the heathen women don't get stacked like that. Man. You know what I mean? It's, it's real. It's real. Um, they refuse to have anything to do with water, particularly in winter. <laughs> when the Huz commander in chief took off his luxurious coat of uh, brocade to don a new coat the mission had brought him, they saw that his underclothes were fraying apart from dirt. For it is their custom, for it is their custom never to take off their garment they wear close to their bodies until it disintegrates. That's nasty. Another Turkish tribe, the Baskars, Baskars, the shave their beards and eat their lice. Ugh. What? That's nice. That's nice. Like, yeah. like the monkeys do. Yeah. Yeah. You know, yeah. The monkeys do. Yeah. So these people are in a beastie state of mind. Here. They search for folds of their undergarments and crack the lice with their teeth because they got it mastered. Like you eat sunflower seeds, how you can master it. You, can, you don't need hands. You just put them in your mouth. A bunch yeah. of hands on your mouth. Crack the seeds, spit it out, and you're still chewing the seed. Uh -huh. Oh, God. They call themselves monkeys anyway. Oh, oh man. God. At the end of the day, they are animals. Oh, man. This book got me. Are we making this up? Did I write this book? Hey, no. even, even uh, General Patton during World War II, he said that the Jews. You know, they're not the real Jews, but he said they was the foulest, filthiest people he'd ever seen in his life. He said he, one of them came up to talk to him in formation or whatever. He said he almost passed out because they stunk so bad. Yeah, look how uh, that bullshit with Hitler, look how they looking, though. They, they look like, well, fucking disease, not taking care of themselves, man. 
Concentration camp, them being gassed and being deprived of food. It was alright because they felt it. Man. Like those camps, those camps they were provided, like like a uh, like you get a membership at a, a country club, man. Yeah. That's what they were, man. Yeah. And a lot of people they was killing with other. Uh, they was killing a lot of whole lot. Jakes. Yeah, they was killing Jakes. Yeah. Jakes. Yeah. That Holocaust shit is bullshit. Yeah. Isn't that, right. There's no such thing as no Holocaust. Right. That's all made up bullshit. And y'all believe it though. Believe what you want. We don't care. Like it matters, bro. Like it matters what yeah what a goon thinks. <laughs> like it matters what the potheum in the you know thing. You know yeah, I mean? that's right, that's right, that's right. They searched the folds of their undergarments and cracked the lice with their teeth. When Ed Fadland watched a bisque shot skyer do this, the latter remarked to him, "They are delicious. Uh. Lice are delicious." Uh. What kind of taste? What do they taste like? Chicken? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What do they taste like? Because the scripture says we can eat Crickets, certain beetles and locusts. And locusts yeah, you know? beetles. A lice ain't part of the locust family, even though them motherfuckers be leaping. I think they leap out. So it's a lice is like a, a tiny roach. <laughs> That's we see people with lice, they just scratch them constantly. <laughs> I know, I remember when I was a. Uh, Last time I had some long hair, years and years ago, I caught mice somehow. I, I, around somebody else. I cut that shit, boy. Never again I had long hair. Turkey. Check this out about their winter turkey. This is about their winter. Oh, you don't want nobody. Hey, before you read it, was it? I'll read it. I'll read that first. I'm gonna see if this says what I think. This is page 45. The sexual moors of the hoods and other tribes were a remarkable mixture of liberalism and savagery. Their women wear no bells in their presence. They said liberalism. Yeah. Well, the whole liberalism movement in America, that's all uh, the so-called Jews behind it, the LGBT, the so-called Jews behind that. Hey, do you know uh, the NAACP, NAACP was uh, started by a so-called Jew? That's a fact. Black Lives Matter was started by Yep, George Soros uh, funds uh, Black Lives Matter. It started by a so-called Jew. That's what you call controlled opposition. You look up the word, look up the phrase controlled opposition. Both sides. The only true opposition to this world and this society is what we doing. That's it. They, they are controlling us and everything except this. Yes, they they don't, don't control us. That's the only thing they can control. That's why they're going to make their moves and that's when the Lord going to crack those stars when they make their moves with us. You know? Their women wear no veils in the presence of the men or strangers, nor do the women cover, cover any parts of their bodies in the presence of people. One day we stay at a place of the hood, hood, hood. And we're sitting around. His wife was also present as we were conversing. Conversing, the woman uncovered her private parts and started scratching them. Oh, uh, we seen that? <laughs> it's our game. We sure did. Yeah. The woman across the street. You see her scratching her pussy. Yeah. And we saw all of it. Thereupon, we covered our faces. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> covered our faces yeah. and said, May God forgive me. The husband laughed and said to the interpreter, Tell them we uncover it in the presence so that he may see and, re and restrain yourself. Because <laughs> you see you. And, and that's how they com combat adultery. <laughs> <laughs> that's their logic. Let, 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 let everybody see that thing and shit. They don't want it. But not these niggas. Nah, they don't want that. Ooh, ooh. They don't want that. They look delicious. <laughs> you know, not niggas. Like, <laughs> Yeah. I was watching this video too on them Jews that uh, the Jews were talking about when they had sex with their women that they would put a sheet down with a hole in it between them and the woman because they she don't want to touch the woman. I've seen it for myself. I've seen it for myself. What kind of weird shit is that, man? That's some weirdo shit. That's crazy. That's a they put a sheet between them and their woman when they have sex with a hole in it. When you put a dick through the hole. That shit's stained. Like when they come out, they just wipe it off at the same time. Oh, man, that's nasty. Yeah. I can't wait till somebody calls themselves a Gentile. I'm gonna look good. Hey, they get, they get, um, they get the physicians to come to their homes. They ain't gotta go to the hospital. Right? They come, the physicians come to their homes. Real quick, real quick. This is uh, Hebrews 12, uh, 16. There should be any fornicator or, or profane person as Esau, who for one mercy of meat sold his birthright. Yeah, because it's so called.